You're Alexis Davis, aren't you? You are. Yeah, I recognize you from your photo. I mean, we've never met, but Danny, my nephew, you're his grandmother. I've never met Danny either, but uh, spinning image of his dad, don't you think? I mean, there are parts of him that do resemble his uncle, right? Right? This is my good side. This is my great side. And I devoutly pray he doesn't have any of your sides. Oh, come on. The kid's likely to grow up to be an artist. You know, a photographer or a painter or a killer. I mean, Jason took contract killing to the level of an art form, don't you think? I mean, as far as I know, he only failed in killing once. And aren't we all so lucky that he failed to kill me? Actually, I'm seriously disappointed that he didn't finish the job. Well, sorry to disappoint you, but here I am, alive and well. Despite all recent efforts to the contrary. I'm surprised that someone went after you. It's just so disconcerting that no one else has, considering the level of damage that you've inflicted. You're hot. You look great up there on your high horse. I would love to photograph you. Like a low angle, super moody, clothing optional. Go away. <laughs> Before I kill you myself. I hope you have better aim than last night's would be assassin. What is that supposed to mean? At the broadside of a barn. Olivia Falconera, on the other hand. Canary was shot. Oh, one minute she's standing there, the next minute she's on the floor. And you were there. Of course. Carly and I had just arrived. Just looked at our menus. Carly agreed to have dinner with you. <laughs> Are you kidding? It was her idea. And how could I say no? I wouldn't give up the opportunity to piss off so many people, including Sonny, who shut up tableside, threatening to drag Carly away by her hair, and then Olivia rushes out all aggravated about something, and then she's on the ground. Sounds like the shot was meant for Sonny. No. Given the angle of the shot and where I was seated, I'm pretty sure the shot was meant for me. And let's face facts. Who would want to kill Olivia? I mean, her accent is cloying, but motive for murder? Did the police make an arrest? Yeah. Oh, you haven't heard? Yeah, your number one client. Sonny Corinthus. Calm down. Sonny's in custody. Someone should have called you. Yeah, somebody should have called me. Although, there's really not a chance in hell that he shot Olivia. Olivia wasn't the target. I was. Don't forget that. Mm -hmm. And Sonny was tableside, so everybody's pretty sure he wasn't the shooter, although it does not preclude the fact that it was one of his pals. And I think that's the theory that the police have embraced. Oh. Either way, it's a good thing I retained Ms. Miller to represent me, not you. <laughs> Trust me, that wasn't an option. Well, it's just as well. You don't seem overly diligent when it comes to your clients. I mean, here, one of your clients is in custody, and you're here chasing your boyfriend, Sean, right? Excuse me, here's Ms. Miller. Now, I'm hoping someday that she allows me to call her Diane, but for now, I'll just have to settle for being free. <laughs> free. So far. You'll have to excuse me. I have to go see a dame about the dismissal. and Sonny on the phone. Who was it? TJ, you know, he's, he's in a pretty bad place over the Molly thing. And, you know, I had to talk him down. TJ called me while you were consoling him. He said he never got a hold of you and you didn't even speak. <sighs> You're a liar. And what business would make you do something like that? Don't forget, we have a, an appointment in court today. The judge is going to rule Sam's on. not going to be able to make it. Okay, well, if Sam doesn't want to continue as Rafe's foster parent, all she needs to do is send a petition. In the hospital. Danny may have leukemia. No. No, not Danny. I gotta go. I have to go to the Okay, house. yes, yes. I'll, uh, I'll get a continuance. Don't worry about anything. You just go be with your daughter. Oh. My nephew Danny is sick. Like you care? Of course I care. Commissioner Devane? Anna, it's Alexis. Are you holding Sonny in connection with the shooting at the Metro Court? Uh, he's been questioned and released. How long was he in custody? Uh, since last night. Based on what evidence? He was a person of interest. You know, it was standard practice for the old regime to pull Sonny in for any shooting, regardless of the evidence or lack thereof. I was hoping this new regime would be different. Yeah, well, we have the right to hold Sonny for 48 hours without charging him. He got out in eight. Overall, I'd say we were pretty accommodating. And the shooter? 
I have no information to release at this time. Thank you. You wanted to see me? Yes, yeah, sit down. What's this about? Well, I have questions for you, sit down. Okay, will this take long? I'm, I'm supposed to be at work. Oh, are we at Kelly's? Or would this be for Sunny? You said you had questions. Yeah, you were aware of the events that took place last night at the restaurant at the Metro Court Hotel? Yeah, it's been all over the television. What does it got to do with me? That depends. On what? If you can account for your whereabouts when Olivia Falconeri was shot. Mm -hmm. I'm late. I got held up. No, it's, it, it's okay, Mom. Actually, Dr. Singh isn't here yet, but Patrick has the results to the biopsy. I just think it's better that we wait for Dr. Singh. Please, Patrick. Come on. I need to know. Patrick, does my son have leukemia or not? Patrick. I'm sorry, Sam. Oh, God. diagnosis what's next i'm not an expert i think it's better we wait for dr singh to discuss danny's treatment options induction therapy to destroy the cancer cells chemotherapy via spinal tap and then maybe radiation how do you know all that i just do on the next general hospital what the hell are you doing do you know something about who shot Olivia? Molly needs me, and uh, she's the only person I want to be with tonight. I'll introduce myself to Lauren. She doesn't go by Lauren. What do you want? Come to Papa.